what the majority of franchisees want, inherit or maybe sell the business, the enterprise to their children. Mr. Franchisee or Mrs. Franchisee, I'm going to tell you that this rarely happens. I don't know why, but there's been many, many children of very successful franchisees that wanted nothing to do with the franchise. As much as we want to build a business and give it to our kids so that they can have a step ahead than what we had when we were their age, the reality is that many of them do not want it. And so you need to be aware of that. Now, if you are a franchisee or business owner that is lucky enough that your kids are interested in doing it, there are a couple of things that you need to take into consideration. One of the things you need to consider is that they may not know how to manage it. And the last thing you want to do is give your children a business that they do not know how to manage well, and then potentially lose it all because of it. If that is the option that you want to take and your kids in reality are interested, my suggestion suggestion is that you get them involved in the business as soon as possible, starting from the bottom, just where you did so that they can truly understand the business. And when they get to have to manage it, they can make the proper decision so that they can protect the legacy that you have built and set them up for success. And that's another thing. If the children are not prepared, children really at this point in time are probably adults, but if these adults are not prepared to run the business successfully, it could end up being a very negative thing for them. Something else that to consider is that if you don't do this, is that this legacy that you have built and worked so much for that is going to be potentially destroyed or minimized. And you really don't want to do that. Something else about this option is that while you're still around, this is not going to be total freedom for you. If your kids are not properly prepared to run the business without you, at least for the first few years, you're going to have to be involved in helping them and guiding them along the way. So maybe that, that's not such a bad thing because while you may not have total freedom, you will have a lot of freedom and you still will need to be around to help them and guide them. And I guess that might also be a great experience for you and your family.